Here in New York, there are actually people that sift through dirt collected from the streets and pan for precious metals, some of them reportedly making up to 300 bucks a day. Now finding something valuable in the street is great, but taking something worthless and somehow turning it into something valuable, that's even more exciting. Wayne is heading down to a construction site to show the workers that there might be untold riches in the gravel under their feet. Hi guys, I'd like to try something using um, rocks. I'm looking for rocks about this size, so if you help me just collect, I just need a handful, yeah. any shape. Um, that's probably good. Yeah, go ahead and drop what you got there. Good, good, good. Hold out your hands. I'm gonna give these to you for just a second. Okay. I've borrowed somebody's sandwich box. Put a little bit of water in there. And Earl, I'd like you to hang on to this for me. Okay. You see the rocks here? How much would you say a handful of gravel like this is worth? Not much. Not much, right? I'm gonna try to change that. I'm gonna take a few. Watch. That one right there at the end. Wow. <laughs> yep, that's it. Look at this. Wow. wow. That's a silver nugget. Take a look. You want to look? Can we make some more of these? We could try. Yeah. You want to you make some more? You want to make some more? All right, let's try. Wow. Here we wow. Go. That is amazing. That one's for you. All right, thank you. But I won't leave you hanging. You can take this. Uh, I don't know if these will change, but you can take them home. You can give it a try. Just drop it into some water. Um, that's it for now. Thank you guys so much. All right. <laughs> Thank you very much. The gravel that we had in our hands that he changed was perfectly normal that we see every day. So it's shocking to see it being able to change into a silver material. It looks valuable as opposed to this unvaluable lot. It was a quick change, but you were able to actually see it happen. Wayne hasn't discovered the secret that turns rocks into silver. And if he had, I don't reckon he'd let on. What he has found out is that heavily tarnished silver looks like gravel. And with sleight of hand, he mixed tarnished silver nuggets into the gravel. The tarnish covering the silver is known as silver sulfide. And when dropped into warm salt water, it reacts with the aluminium foil, creating a current that passes between the silver sulfide and the foil. This transfers the sulfur atoms to the foil, revealing the silver underneath. 